I am done. On behalf of the Detroit Skating Club in Bloomfield Hills, Michigan, Tara Lipinski. Tara Lipinski disappointed after the short program, but the best thing about this 15-year-old is that she doesn't get down, she gets angry. She needs to win the free skate and have a third place finish by Michelle Kwan or lower in order to win the championship. Well, the first time I saw Tara was two years ago, and what struck me the most was her eagerness and her joy. And that is absolutely still the beauty of her skating. She fell on this on the short program. And look at the step up into the jump. Now this was a jump very, very little. That's almost like a roller skating lift off into the jump, but it was beautifully done. And this is what she fell on in the short program, the triple flip. Now watch to see the kick and the turn and the step. Whoa. Oh, she was determined a, to do that well. Just a tight landing, a slight landing on a back inside edge, but perfect position. She's happy with that. She should be. This, the Lutz jump. Again, watch the back outside edge to see if it switches over. Beautiful combination. Very solid. This evening is taking off. Circular steps. Born in the Philadelphia area, her early years spent in nearby New Jersey. There's a lot of family here tonight. Has had to change her plan. And no senior lady has come from fourth to win after the short program since the school figures were done away with in 1991, but it has happened on the junior level. And now coming up is her triple, triple combination. The first skater to ever do a triple loop, triple loop combination. Watch the landing right there and the step up in it. A little bit of a turn, but beautifully done otherwise. Full revolution, perfectly good position, except just at the very end, a slight, slight lean. But so what? That's a very handsome way to catch foot spin. You didn't have to drop it. Beautifully done. Triple Lutz jump, long edge. Wonder, that's it. See, she's just really giving a performance of her life. She is sailing through this program. She's feeling this music, using her arms so much better than last year. And her final triple combination, a triple toe, half loop, triple sal cow. Triple toe, half loop, triple sal cow. <laughs> well, what a justification for her. What a comeback. Just slightly <laughs> off the beat. Again, she took a little too much time to get into it. But what a magnificent performance. She's an incredible young lady. How great it is that the ladies skate well, that they fulfill all the requirements, and they, they do such a first-rate job. That's what makes them feel magnificent. She had three words for us yesterday. 
I'll be back. Well, she is. Well, it must be very satisfying for her. Just gave us another reason to understand why she reached the pinnacle. Wasn't and here was a look at her history making triple loop, triple loop combination. The first one, the second one, the landing was a little shaky, but very determined. And here is this final combination. Watch this. First a triple toe loop, beautifully done. Very tight, clean, and perfect. A half loop right there. And a triple soccer. And watch the landing there. That's fighting to hold it, and she did it just fine. Now remember, she needs to win the free skate and have Michelle Kwan finish third or lower to win. The technical merit marks five eighths and five nines. And they're just about right. She had a couple of tiny, tiny glitches. Five eight, five nine is perfect and they're higher than those of Nicole Boba which is Callahan Megan Faulkner along with her they're high the technical marks were higher because her her technique was higher and much more demanding these marks also very good very fine and those marks high enough Dick to allow Tara to take the lead right now over Nicole Bobek, and that is extremely important obviously but Nicole Bobek was in second place and the title was there for her to go after.